In this video, I will show you how to perform a 3D calibration tracking into Studio. To save you time, I would recommend to perform this calibration as soon as you enter in Studio. Once your calibration is done, you are all ready to focus only on what matter your presentation. Let's open a playlist and send a clip to Studio. As you see, the 3D tracking didn't perform. Let's click on the button 3D tracking sitting next to the Chroma one and run the 3D tracking. You will see a progress bar that indicates that Studio is doing the 3D tracking calibration automatically. Once done, the button appears in green and as well you will see a green bar with 3D that indicates where the 3D tracking performed well. In some occasions, due to the field visibility for example, it can happen that the tracking didn't run as expected. In this case, we need to do it manually. Let's click again on the 3D tracking and click on Add Calibration Frame. At the right of Studio appear some options. Choose the correct position of the camera. Choose or not snap to the line that will help the line to stick to the field and display or not the field. From there you have two options. Either drag point from the virtual field, either drag point from the real field. Click on the point, use the zoom at the, at the top right of your screen to place it correctly. I'd recommend to do so for at least two or three points of the field. Once you're happy with the manual calibration that you did and the red line stick to the field, please close and run the 3D tracking again. In this way, Studio will perform again the 3D calibration, taking in consideration the manual points that you have created. Your manual 3D tracking is done. A last tip, if you think you will use this field again in future projects with Studio, you can save this manual 3D tracking calibration. Click on 3D tracking and go camera calibration. Here you will have the save calibration op option. Click on it. To save this calibration. In the right panel of Studio, Show Asset and Calibration, you will have all the calibration that you already perform manually into Studio. And you will be able, the next time you work within Studio with the same stadium, to simply load the exi existing calibration. By clicking on this button, or applied here. This will save you a lot of time. The last tip, as the chroma, you can tick the start camera tracking immediately after video import. This will run the 3D tracking automatically. I hope this video helped you. Thank you for watching.